Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing Indiana Jones by Stern Pinball today. Please look for our review underneath the description of our YouTube video, as well as like and follow us on our social media formats, Arcade and Pinball Talk, under Facebook groups, Instagram, Twitter, as well as click that red subscribe button. Other than that, let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? One million. First impressions on the machine are looks really good. I'm a huge Indiana Jones fan. And again, this is a routed machine, so obviously, with that said, there are some things that are working on this machine. There are some things that are not, so I'll go ahead and preface with that right now. theme is Indiana Jones. I'm liking it. It's working for me. Also, uh, the artwork looks good for what it is based on the time frame that this game came out. Uh, let's jump into table mechanics real quick. Flipper gap is a little wider. There's actually a stop peg below the flippers. Uh, in lanes to the left and right, out lane to the left and right. You got targets that are going up that spell Indy to the left side. You have a scoop, which is Last Crusade. You have another scoop with a captive ball above it that says Temple of Doom. You have a lane in between those scoops with pop bumpers that go up and around the back of the table, which completes an orbit. Uh, you have another captive ball to the right of the, that area, which shoots the ball into targets to the left of uh, the left of the box there. And then you also have Raiders of the Lost Ark, which is uh, which is an area where if you hit the ball up there, it could open. Also, you have a magnet that whips it around. Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, which is a ramp that goes all the way up and habit trails and exits to your left end lane. And you have targets that says Indiana Jones to the right. So very, very, very specific kind of table. And one that I would say that I actually like. Uh, a lot of people like the older Indiana Jones uh, from the early uh, 80s time period. And what I would say is that's a beautiful table too, but you know, gotta give credit where credit is due. This. Uh, this Indiana Jones table is actually actually pretty nice. I like it. Sound bites are actually there. You, you feel like it's almost like Raiders of the Lost Ark and and everything kind of tied into it. So I think that this is a really good encompassing pinball machine. Soundtrack is there. Jones got it. Mystery is lit. Do you believe that? I would say that uh, fun factor on, on this machine, I think it's there too. I think you got quite a few shots to the front of the play field. You got targets to the left and the right. Having two scoops there is very interesting. And then also having a scoop that has a captive ball on the top of it. I think that's pretty cool. That's definitely different. Back to my fun factor thing. I mean, you have a multi-ball that has five to six balls on it. That definitely is pretty cool. And with all of our videos, of course, when you find the review, the, re the review is not only us talking about what we like and dislike at the table, uh, but our review is generally gonna be in the description of the video, so you can find that uh, on desktop. You'll, it'll say show more underneath the video. You can click there, and that's where our review will be written out. All of our metrics will be in there. Uh, also on mobile, there's a little triangle uh, that that is in the, that is right below the headline of the video. And if you click there, you'll find our metrics under there written out as well. So far, so good. I'm actually liking this table. Looks great, sounds great. Seems to be playing really good. Got quite a few shots to it. We are in a uh, we 
we are in an area that is uh, car country in Shepherdsville, Kentucky, and uh, actually looking at this machine today. So of course it is a routed machine, lights are very dim. Uh, so of course you try to capture these machines the best that you can with the equipment that you have on hand. Uh, but you know, in person this machine is, is really nice. Other than that, please look again for our review under the description of our video. Uh, please subscribe if you like arcade pinball, if you like regular pinball, mechanical. Please click the subscribe button. Join our family. We appreciate you watching today. Thank you again for your time.